Is this just fear porn, or is there something to this, folks? I believe that there most likely is. China feared to be hiding missiles in shipping containers for Trojan horse-style attack. Now, folks, this information has been uh, floating around out there for a bit of time, but uh, it has popped up again today, so I thought I would cover it with you. Uh, especially when you consider that 96 container ships were waiting to dock at uh, Southern California ports on Sunday, the uh, 5th of December. Uh, China has been secretly developing Trojan horse-style missiles hidden in shipping containers that can be unleashed on enemy ports, experts warn. Now, military analysts believe the country's huge fleet of freighters and fishing vessels could be turned into warships, with the use of the secretive container missiles. And again, when I think of all those containers out there off the uh, West Coast, I've been thinking this for some time. Uh, with the delay of getting them into port, the delay of getting them unloaded, could there be a concern over this? Now, these, uh, these would be disguised as regular shipping containers, and they can be sneaked on board a vessel to blend in seamlessly with hundreds of others on board. And uh, the sheer number of these container ships in the world would make them hard to pinpoint, um, harder than w regular warships. So is it possible that China could be considering sneaking in not only missiles, but I've seen uh, information pointing to drones, helicopters, all sorts of things to possibly stage an attack on the U.S. or on some other nation? Um this is something I think we need to consider, especially when we have all those container ships out there off the coast. Now, here's a mock-up of these missiles, if you can see that. And again, you can see how they would be down inside these containers here and then just, um, you know, by remote control, hoisted up and then fired. I mean, is this is this far-fetched? I don't think it is. Now, um, a... Uh, Retired Navy Captain Jim uh, Fennell, who was part of the uh, Pacific Fleet, and he was a former Pacific Fleet Intelligence Chief, has previously said a containerized anti-ship missile would add a significant threat to the U.S. Navy. So with everything going on out there in the ports, um, I personally believe this is something that uh, we should certainly have uh, in the forefront of our minds. Could some of those containers out there on those ships be packing some of these Chinese missiles to possibly be used on an attack on the U.S. When you look at the, at the, uh, the world uh, situation in total right now, um, you know, uh, China could make a move on Taiwan, and then while we're distracted with that, uh, attempting in some way to defend Taiwan, they could then uh, release these missiles from those container ships and use them on the United States. It's certainly something to consider, folks. I will leave you a link to this. Please like this video. Please share it. Please subscribe. And please check out the links below, if you would, to my various enterprises. Um, Please uh, hit the bell icon so you can, uh, when you subscribe, you can get notification of new videos. Most importantly of all, folks, no matter what, it's the blood of Jesus. It's the blood of Jesus that will save us and protect us. So do not be given over to the spirit of fear, but instead of the power of love and of a sound mind that comes through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. This is Jim signing off. God bless you, and I will see you soon.